Hello all, this is a tutorial for Construction Calc. It's an app um, that works on iOS, uh, which is iPhone and iPad, also on Android and Blackberry. It's a free app. It's funded by this little bar at the bottom full of ads. And I am just going to go over the basics today. Um, the unique basics to this calculator. So we're not going to go over you know, how to add and multiply and all that, but we're going to go over um, imperial measurements and metric measurements and how to work with them on this calculator. So the first thing we'll do is enter a imperial measurement and the way you do that is um, one unit at a time. So let's say we have a, uh, I don't know, ceiling height or whatever, eight feet, so we'll go eight feet, eight and then the foot button. Um, say it's five inch, we'll go five inch and then say it's three sixteenths. So at this point we're going to enter the numerator, 3, numerator, 16th, denominator. And now we have our full measurement up here, 8 foot, 5 and 3 sixteenths of an inch. And at this point, of course, we can work with that. So we could add 2 feet, for example, and we'll get our result. Um, another thing unique to this calculator is the memory locations. So we'll just go over that quick. Um, you can select all your different memory locations, there's 10 of them with the up and down arrows. And then of course you can add to memory, you can subtract from memory. Um, MR is uh, to recall from memory and MC will clear memory. Uh, other nice thing about memory is it will put your value into decimal value. So if you need to do a quick conversion, but when you pull it back out it will put it back in fractional value. Um, entering metric is similar. You'll hit 8 meters, 54 centimeters, 23 millimeters, and you'll get your full number. This screen is scrollable, as is the top screen, although it's nothing big enough to scroll right now. Now, the other thing we need to go over that is very handy with this calculator is uh, instant one button conversions so if you have a measurement of I don't know 126 feet now any other button I press uh, measurement wise it will convert to that so if I want that in meters I can press meters it'll give you my 38 meters 40 centimeters and 4 millimeters uh, I can go to centimeters well actually that'll break that down so I guess it doesn't matter oh there we go uh, you can break it down to centimeters, that's 384,040 uh, centimeters. You can break it down to millimeters if you really wanted to, which is a large number. And we'll put it back to meters. And that will, of course, work the other way. If you have 80 meters, you can convert it to yards or feet. It'll break it down 291 feet, 7 and 9 sixteenths of an inch. Uh, the display button is another thing that will switch between memory, um, your settings, so you know at all times what settings you have going on, and the history. Uh, you have a few buttons at the top. Upgrade will upgrade you to CCalc Pro, which is uh, the same program, but it also contains all kinds of other modules for conversions, stair calculations, uh, miter calculations, material estimation, tons of stuff, so check that out. It's pretty awesome. Um, and the settings will get you a setting screen. Uh, inch precision, a lot of time guys will put this on 1 16th since your measuring tape usually will show 1 16th or 16th rather. Decimal precision, try to keep this high. If you put it low you'll uh, notice some um, because it'll round the decimal to such a small precision you'll get weird fractions. Not weird fractions but you'll get fractions that uh, that aren't broke down right. So try to keep that high unless you're working uh, in something specific that you need that. Lock denominator, if that's on the denominator, it will not reduce. So it'll show a 32 64th instead of reducing it down to a half inch. If you take that off, it will reduce your fractions. Um, include yards off, that means that you'll just get feet, inches and fractional inches, but no yards. If that's on, you'll get yards. Uh, and of course, button sound will give you uh, audio feedback when you press the buttons. Awesome, so that's about it for now. Thanks for watching.